Hello, this is Sheila She's Beauty Forever, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be going back into, yet again, the Morphe 39S palette. I liked how it performed the other day when I used it, and I just thought I want to go back into it again. So if you want to see what look I create using this palette, then keep on watching. And if you are new, welcome. Please, I encourage you to subscribe and push the notification bell so you'll know every time I upload a video. So, let's get into this palette. All right. I just woke up and felt like doing another look. Wasn't doing anything else. Happy more day to everybody. All right, let me get into this palette. See what my first color is gonna be. All right, now grab my Morphe E17 brush, okay? And I think I want to go into this pretty color right up here. And that color is called Posh Boss. No, not Posh Boss, uh, Bougie. Spelled with two J's, let me see. I can't see y'all. Yeah, Bougie spelled with two E's. <laughs> right here. Okay. Going right into the crease. Ooh, yeah, it is nice and pigmented. I've already primed my eyes. So, we're going to just dip right on in. It is really pretty, nice and vibrant. I was going to put a lighter color on my lids, but I said, hey, we're just going to go with it. I'm just gonna go with it. I got my tape on here to give me a nice little guide. I decided to start out early this morning because I had to work this evening. And I just said, might as well get on in here right now. Pretty. Hope you all can see that. Really pretty. And the shirt I have on is a pretty mauvey purple color. <laughs> so I'm going to do something pertaining to the shirt. So we've done that color in that eye. Let's go to the second eye. Hope you all can see me pretty well. I wore purple the other day. But I want to bring get something a little more pizzazzy as far as the color, the color scheme. So one eye is bigger than the other one. So I want to get as close as possible to the same shape on my eyes. I'm gonna try to. Now 
is a very pigmented. Mm. Ooh wee! Both did their thing on this pattern, honey. Yes, they did. And my videos are not sponsored. Turn a little to the front so I can see exactly what I'm doing. Make sure they are even out real good. Okay. Okay, let me get another brush to clean off the edges. Smooth them out. Man, it's really good. Nice and clean. Okay. Brightness. Let's see. This is more blue. I think this way. Nah, there you go. All right. Now go back in to the crease. Alright, now let's find a deeper color and I think I want to use this color down here and that's called Plums Up. Okay, now use that same brush, the E17 brush. Come to the outer corner and into the crease. Come on closer to you all. Let me see. Yeah, I should be close enough. If you all see the smoothness of this wind. Patting it on, blending it out. Mm -hmm. Y'all see that? You see the deepness of the colors? I'm itching to use this pressed glitter in here. It's really pretty. I think I want to use it. Oh, 
entire leg. Pressing and patting. Make sure we get that color in there real good. Okay, go back into that lighter color and clean my brush off. Back into that lighter pink and bring it over. Back in and clean up the edges again. All right, y'all see that? Two different colors. Now, we're going to do some concealer. I'm going to use just a random brush for my cut crease. Like that. So my line is supposed to be. Okay, you all see that? Okay. Y'all are not the best when it comes down to cut creases, okay? Putting it out there. Okay, got that one. Alright. Alright, do the same for this eye. See what I said? Well, one eye is bigger than the other. Got the same shape pretty much, but this eye is deeper in the crease too as well. The hood is very deep. So when I do this, it look awkward. Okay, so I have to go up a little bit more on this eye. It's gonna be weird or awkward when I have my eyes like book like this but as I'm all day like this in a regular face mode they'll look the same so I have to go up more on this eye so 
make them look even down. Now it don't look so bad. I kind of got them even down a little bit. See what I'm saying? And if I'm turning with y'all, let me get y'all see. Kind of get them evened out. That's another reason I have to turn away from you all sometimes. And I don't have where I can put my camera right in front of me because there's not a lot of room here. Because my vanity mirror is like right here. And I have to have my makeup stuff right in front of me. That's why I have to look sideways. So y'all bear with me, okay? And I'm blind in my left eye. I try to mention it in all my videos because, you know, we always have, you know, new people watching the video. So I want to make sure I mention that fact that I am blind in my left eye. So I have to look over to the side a lot. Okay, now, let it dry, pat it down a little bit with a clean brush, I mean, this is just a basic moisture brush, you don't have the number on it, and you pat it down, help it dry a little bit more. I'll take a smaller brush. Let me see if I should use the E18 or one smaller. Let me see. This is the E36. I think I just got one because this one's a little bit bigger than this one. I'm just going to go in and be a little bit more precise with the color around where the crease area is. Maybe I should do it now. I should wait. Let me see. I'll try it now. So you all can see the cut crease really good. Now I'm going to pat in another color. Pat in this pretty color right here called Marvelous. And that's this pretty 
mauve color here. It's like, it's like a glitter. I mean, not a glitter, but a. Uh, oh shit, let me show you. How pretty that is. That's really pretty. It's a pink shimmer shade. Could that way. <laughs> Could get that out like I wanted to. So, you grab another brush. And I'm grabbing the Morphe M166 brush. This color here. I'm gonna put, I think I'm going to use that press glitter and put it right on the top of that. I don't have to emphasize this shimmer color as much because, like I said, that press glitter is going over the top of it. To this pressed glitter. Now I do have a sponge somewhere. I like to use the sponge from our uh, palettes. You know those palettes with those weird sponges. And I use these as the for the application for the pressed glitter. Okay. This pressed glitter is called Show Off. Right. Here. Okay, it's really pretty. All right. Right in the Show Off. Those, these little sponges are really good for this. Gives you some precision as well. And you don't have to throw these things away after all. Because I used to throw them away real quick. But what in the world am I supposed to do with this? So I'm using the edge of one that's clean, the other side that's clean. Bring that glue down. Now, for the 
besar. Fingers to make sure that crisp glitter is down really good. I'm going to deepen up the outer crease. Where did my lovely brush go? Let me find my brush. Let me find my brush. Okay. I want the outer crease a little bit deeper. So I'm going to go into this glittery type of black right here. And that is called Rocks On. Okay. Clean it out into the glitter. Playing right there. Effect. Okay, other side. You all said bringing that glitter over into the black. Shadow. It's already got glitter in it, but this glitter is going into that black, so it's got giving that nice brilliant effect. Very nice. Deeper maroon color. Okay. 
flicking it because I'm cleaning it up too, some of that glitter. We our liner and we have our glam light calligrapher liner. It's a really pretty liner. It's a feather calligrapher. It's a felt tip. Sometimes lining over glitter can be difficult, but these felt tips are perfect for that. Make sure you have a good felt tip in your, in your box or in your drawer, okay? Keep one on hand. Very good with uh, mine over glitters. We're going to take this tape off because we are done pretty much with this. Clean that up. Okay. 
you know, it looks like the tape off. Some of it might have gone under the tape, okay? We so will clean that up with some concealer or some foundation. You wrapped up now. So I'm going to get my wipe, clean off the glitter. Okay, let's get our foundation. Let's see, what happened with foundation now? Mm, 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 mm. I didn't put it back up already. Oh. I feel like I got some good in my eye. Okay, we found the foundation. Oh, let me see, let me go up here. Grab my concealer and foundation. This is my one this way by Too Faced in the color of cocoa. Take it up. Two pumps. Okay, clean up that line. This I did pretty good. Just a little bit. Okay. See that, y'all? All right. I look good on every side. Okay. Conceal it. This is the one this worn this way. Yep. Concealer. And chestnut. Give a little bit of a highlight. Okay. I'm a husband outside barbecue and he's about to chop his finger off with them reels. So you got to be careful. So do I need to go to the emergency room? I'm like, nah, come on in. Got them cleaned up and everything. So he doing all right. Got to be careful. As soon as I get ready to finish, here you come and no more chop your fingers off. Okay. 
they can seal it all. Now let me get my contour stick by Fenty Beauty. It's about to run out. to grab me another contour stick and I was in Ulta the other day and I didn't even grab it. First thing I hate is when I'm at, trying to shop and my phone ring. It throw me all the way off. I'm like, be bothered when I'm shopping. setting powder and this is my uh, Laura Mercier translucent powder in deep I'm not going to do my baking. I'm going to go back in and do my brows as well. My brows are not disappeared on me. I love to smile. When I'm at work, I smile all day. Okay. Okay, let's smooth out the bottom lash line. I think I want a light color under there. use my milk pencil by NYX. Get me a small little brush to put that smudge on the bottom of my lash line to brighten it up. Overwhelming, but I want to be to be seen. And a little extra oomph under that last lamp. Okay. I'm gonna smudge it out with this highlighter pink I had earlier. Which is called, like I said, Posh Boss. That one, or should I do, is uh, Very Good. I think I'm going to do Very Good. That's this one right here. I need Very Good. Pop my face that quick. Look at that. We gonna fix it, don't worry. We gonna fix it. Okay. 
है You always got that one eye that you do perfect from the other eye. some mascara. This is my toothpaste better than sex mascara. Making a mascara of uh, accident, y'all. I told y'all about. Now that's tight line. Right on the last line with the top. Steep as the eye look and make sure your lashes, your natural lashes, look a little bit more fuller. Okay? with tight line and I'm gonna put some in the water line. Deepen the look a little bit. Now let me get this mascara off my face. Had to let it dry before I touched it. Okay. Now let me touch on right here. Like that. Now let 
go back into uh, Rocks On, which is that black color. Come up in here where the uh, glitter is radiating. Now we need to highlight the inner corner. I'm going to highlight with this pretty color right here. And that's called Pearl Pearl Fiction. Pearl Fiction. Mm -hmm. Love a highlight in the center. Line it up. Open the eyes up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I need to fix my brow. And let me see, where it is? My brow, 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 brow. I be so unorganized. I have so much up on this thing here. Let me brush my brows up. I didn't have a very good brow day. But at the same time, my foundation kind of made my brow disappear. Got that on there. Mm -hmm. Now let me deepen up my jaw bones, my cheekbones, and this is my May Cheek Modern Fashion Contour. I love this because it's got nice, nice deep contour colors in there. And this one right there for my cheek. I like that. A little soft. You want to come up a little bit more with it. And look around the forehead. Rain nickel brush. It's nice and nice. There you go. Need some bowies going on. There we go. Now let me get my blush and I'm going to use my Royal Lane Nipple Brush again. No, no, I ain't. I'm going to use my uh, Lush, Luxie Brush. This one right here. The one we got out of our Boxy Charm about a month or maybe two months ago. She kind of got a little shimmer in her. I'm going to throw it in your highlight.
little, little cheeks. Little heart cheeks. Mm -hmm. It's really pretty. I don't really need a highlight. But you know I'm going to use a highlight anyway. Okay. Now, let me get my highlighter. Which is my M. Weezy highlighter by Anastasia Baby Hills. Okay. I'm highlight brush. That's the Morphe M438 brush. My favorite highlighting brush. Center of the nose, forehead, chin, keep it bow, though I do not have my dip on yet. Ears, put the excess on my ears. All right, the mold. Now let me do my lip. Then I'm gonna do my bite beauty. I have my bite beauty lip color uh, pencil. And I don't know what color that is. Let me see. That is the lip crayon in 044. I see a name for it. Okay, I have a beautiful mauve color that matches my shirt. It's really pretty. This is a uh, Amuse Bouge in the color Demi Glaze. Really pretty mauve color here. Let's see this one. Okay. These lips smell so good. We want to eat the dog on thing. The lipstick. Got a nice little gloss to it. We go on to my Julius Place palette, blush palette, and going into adding this little. I think I should do some lashes, y'all. Let me see. Do some lashes. Oh. These are my Broadway lashes. I'm going to use this pair right here. Very really pretty pair there.
brush my lash out right quick. Curl my lash and give a little wave to it. These are considered center lashes. These are very dramatic center lashes. You go right in the middle of your eyes. Darn it. on my little tweezers. Dramatic that one. Oh. Let me spray my face with my Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. Marry everything together. And let me grab my socks first of all. <laughs> my earrings. Now, excuse me, I got it. all over myself. The 
with the three earrings to go with the look. These are the earrings, as y'all can see. See the nice pretty earrings. We got the nice little uh, rhinestones in the middle of the earrings. We fit the shirt and the eye. If y'all can see that, you need to go in here, clean up just a little bit. Let me get a brow bone highlight. Can't forget brow bone highlight. Let's put the brush. Brow bone highlight on the brush right here. y'all like it hope y'all like this video it was kind of long but i know over an hour but this is the final look hope y'all like it get my eyes on let me marry them lash together now since they kind of dry Nice dramatic lash. But here we are. Hope y'all like this video and this beautiful makeup look that I came up with today from our Morphe 39. It's such a gem palette. An artistry palette. 39 pans of nice shimmery metallic glitter, pressed glitter, and matte shades. Uh, toppers as well. Hey, I enjoyed this look myself. I hope you all like it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. I love to have you as a part of the Urban Beauty community. Hey, and make sure you push that notification bell so you know every time I upload a video. But well, here you go. These beautiful colors that I use. I use this one here, this one right here, this one here, and this beautiful shade. Alright, this is the finished look. Until next time, people. Love, peace, and taco grease. Love you guys. Bye. Y'all, I had to come back in because I wasn't through blending my face makeup. I said, oh my goodness, no, I didn't. But I got the hair. Y'all know we have some bloops and blunders every now and then. So, let me come back in. Get some act right in my life. Now nah, that's better. I had left that part out when I ended my video. You know that ain't right. But like I said on my channel, it's raw and uncut. You're gonna see mistakes and everything. Sometimes you may miss a spot, and I tend to do that sometimes. But hey, I come back and let y'all know and show y'all things like that happen. So, I got my blend on. And 
I'm blending to make sure everything is cohesive. But I'm back. I just did that to make sure y'all knew I wasn't going at this house like that, okay? I always tend to go back over and look at myself, but I didn't do it that time, you know. Huh. But here is the finished look. Don't my light back on for y'all. Here you go. Everything is nice and blended. So y'all know I didn't leave out the house looking crazy. <laughs> hey, but this is she with she beautiful urban. Signing out till next time. Love, peace, and taco grease. Love you guys. Bye.